Hello guys, welcome to another time out with me on Alec GTV. My name is Alec Godwin and um, today we are looking at what's in my camera bags. Because I don't do one bag. Coming up. All right, welcome back. Um, if you're new here, I would appreciate if you subscribe right now. At some point, like, comment, subscribe. Fans that are already here, that have been here on this channel and been connected all along, I appreciate you, I applaud you as well. You guys rock. I, I'm so grateful for your support. For me, what's in my camera bag feels like letting you into my privacy. I mean, so you might as well just come into my room, right? Um, but that's not the reason I really uh, wanted to shoot it here. After everything was done, uh, I just wanted to just stretch out this way and be gone. <sighs> okay, so that part will come before I forget. I want to let you know that uh, YouTube just added a new feature, not for everybody, but I'm one of the privileged ones to have it. It's the applause, applaud feature, and all you have to do is uh, click on it. There is going to be some donations. I think it's a minimum of two dollars or so, something like that. Um, just to appreciate any YouTuber of your choice, anywhere you see that upload is going to be, from what they said, is going to be on a select um, few. Um, on their channel and in and you're supposed to like you know if you love the video you make a donation um, that I will appreciate uh, I really wasn't gonna go into patreon and uh, try to raise funds and stuff but since they gave me this let me have this feature I would love to you know appreciate show my appreciation by actually using it uh, rather than ignoring that they didn't give it to everybody so if I can get it I might as well use it and it will it's not like I don't need it it will be appreciated but I just don't want to push all that money stuff you know so um, but I will appreciate it if it's okay with you if it's okay by you you love the video and this video or any other video go ahead and and um, click um, the upload button and make a donation and that will be appreciated it will help the channel go to the next level thank you all right everything is on board it's time where do we begin i've got four bags here i'll explain why this is how I wrote, this is how I travel. This is not how I travel. This is an idea of how I travel. This will be like this, and then there'll be boxes and stuff like that. Um, yeah, but if it's the light shoot, this is what's in my camera bags. Um, sometimes, some, some of it might be able to fit into... There's one missing. We are going nowhere without this. I'll start with this. This is uh, the newer bag. Um, um, well, it's an, it's just an okay bag. I'm not gonna say nothing about it. I needed a bag fast, I got it. And um, yeah, it's okay, nothing special. It does the job. It's too small anyway. Maybe a bigger bag will convey some more of this stuff, but but my lenses, I, it just had to be the Pelican and I'll come to that in a minute. So, um, so let's start with the most important, right? Which is the nucleus or the base or the foundation of everything, which is... Black Magic Pocket Cine My Camera 4K. Ooh, 
Mmm. <laughs> This camera came into my life at the right time. Happy that she came into my life and you know and we met at the right time and uh, the connection was just off of this world. Now, uh, so this is how I move it around. It's millimeters, that's very wide. It's, it's, it's very wide. And it's very good on gimbal. Saved me on my last shoot and uh, I wasn't, it wasn't gonna be the lens I used, but I was glad that it was there because that's how it was there. It was only there because I, I, I transport this camera this way. But at the end of the day, I ended up, you know, it was the wide angle I used because I, I had in mind to use a fish eye lens, but this one did the job quite well. So this is my main camera. Um, right now I'm recording on the Sony FS5. I know that's strange, right? Yeah, but that's uh, that's my. <laughs> I think I'm stuck with this camera right now. Uh, I'm, my review is coming out for the next three years or so. I I will be stuck with that camera. There's nothing I can do, and there's no running away. We'll talk about the lenses and stuff like that. Next thing, you wanna. You want to blow your lenses, okay? Keep them clean. Um, I don't want to miss anything. Okay, this is not so important, but it's always in my bag. It's a um, charger for the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera, the uh, Canon LP blah, blah, blah series. Um, this is from uh, was Wasabi Power. Wasabi, and uh, I have a couple of, well, I started with a couple of their batteries and uh, along with the battery that came with it, the Canon one. So this charges the Canon as well, but the I, good thing is that I can charge both at the same time. So um, so two at the time, and they charge pretty fast. So this is very good. I highly recommend it if you're not, you know, you need a double charger for this guy. If you're depending on that charger though, but even though I don't depend on it that much, I still have it handy because when I want to go rock the gimbal, I probably use it, okay? Um, what else, okay? All right, this is the only lens that's in this camera bag. Okay, there's another one. That's because it's attached to the camera. We'll come to that. But this is the only lens that's in this, officially in standing alone in this camera bag. And it is one of my favorite lenses. It is cheap. But it is one of my favorite lenses. It is the Canon FD 70 to 210 macro lens at f4. Um, it's not a fast lens, but this lens is very smooth. What you could do with it, everything that you will see, all the items I talk about, I'm gonna get their shots. You will see their shots, like uh, you know, on a close up and everything. Um, the Mikey reviews, most of my reviews when I do close up of products, this is the lens that I use. It's so very smooth. It's just the macro ability is just awesome you know um i would love to compare it someday with the canon 100 uh, l series um lens 2.8 i think yeah i'm hoping to get that lens someday but but i won't get that lens until i'm sure it can beat this guy hands down because i'm gonna make then i'm gonna switch okay but for now this is very good for the price of about 40 bucks or something like that some ridiculous price i'll put the links i know i love this thing so much i, I probably want to say too much but i'll try to summarize it this camera i have said in a couple of videos that i was going to do a review on this camera and i never did god help me i still want to do it this camera is so good this is the zoom q4n this camera well you might not need it you it might not make sense to you because you have all the gorgeous cameras and stuff like that but I know it saved me and it still saved me a lot uh, let me just give you an idea if you are starting YouTube for the first time you won't, don't want to spend much 
this is about 200 and 45 something like that i'm sure the prices come down now i'll put the links too but the bottom line is these zoom cameras are made for audio the audio is excellent like you know it, it's got a screen and that's why i choose it over over uh, uh, a gopro now the gopro has 4k this is 2.3k but the picture difference is not so much uh the audio difference is extra much you don't have to pay extra gadget to put all that gadget together and you know put, this is ready to go like like all you have to do is get a hand grip and uh you're ready to go vlogging is started you have a side screen here people don't realize this is a very good startup camera very cheap and even though i don't use i don't need it for as my main camera i still depend on it a lot the battery for this it lasts more than a gopro almost twice and it, it does everything the gopro does not as wide which is okay for me because i really don't want the super wide i should do a, a review i should do a review comment below if you want me to do a review of this thing because i'm i'm sure it will blow your minds always in my bag always in the bag i might miss a gopro but not this next on the list is uh my canon m50 i got it uh, a couple of years ago you know when it came out and uh, when it was a sensation and this with this i shot my first shot movie 2020 which was uh, a futuristic uh, movie so you might want to go check that out um yeah it's on this uh, it's 2020 kind of i put it right here now so i love this camera you know about it already you know what 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 it does um i'm rocking with the com light adapter it works pretty good um you know they sent it to me so i settled for that um next is uh oh yeah the gopro hero 8 oh not 8 sorry ah no 7 i just bought 7 like a month or two and 8 came i was like get out of here i'm not getting it i use them for behind the scenes uh, along with this um, camera I talked about, the zoom yeah, for behind the scenes and um, you know just wide shots of you know what's going on. Yeah, I mean I won't I won't be buying the the eight unless something goes wrong. All right, you already seen it. This guy, yeah, 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 Mavic Pro, DJI Mavic Pro. This this was the sensation back then, you know, and it still is. Still, a, still is a good drone, you know. I mean, almost, you know, it's there. It's 4K, good picture. I mean, I'm good with this for now. Decent, decent job, okay. I win the award of the longest was in my camera video. All right, so we're done with this side. Let's uh, wrap up this side. What's here? What's here? HDMI cable. Oh, I just had this new HDMI cable. I always leave it in in my bag. It's not opened yet because I've never forgotten to have another HDMI, HDMI cable, but I'm not going to take it out there, out of here in my bag because, uh, yeah, some point, some, someday, sometime, I will forget. Oh, I will need an extra one and this will be handy. I'm trying to skip some things. Come back down. Okay, this is for Canon M50. For those of you who don't know, there's a direct power. I shot the video. I will try to put uh, make that video up where I demonstrated. You know, I've shot it for about a year now. If I eventually can uh, actually edit it and put it out. I'll put a link in the description here. But you might want to know how to use this and um, you know how to set it up and how well it can benefit you. Okay. Yeah. One more thing is uh, this thing from Fantasy. I'm sure we'll see it all over my bag. You buy anything from them, they'll give you this. So, but they always give you that cloth. It helps me keep my devices clean. All right. So we're done on the first bag. Yeah. Let's do lenses. What do you want? Lenses. Uh, GoPro. Let me hit the GoPro one out of the way. Um, I'll do try to do this in the summary. Now the GoPro accessories they are very important as well. Why do I do this separately? These are as important 
as the other gadgets I said themselves. Now, I got this bag from Fantasy. Oh, that's the cloth I was just telling you about. You know, it's so nice, it's so portable, but it's for GoPro tools. Now, I had one of these um, two boxes for GoPro accessories. You know, not this fine. It's just, it's just there. When you open it up, all the things come rushing out. You know, so I moved some of the things here along with my GoPro accessories, um, Hero 7 and uh, 5. I put them all here, both the third party and the um, GoPro um, accessories. I put them in the bag. It's a lovely bag. I'll show you the picture. I'm not going to reveal it, but I have a, an unboxing for it. I might show you the clip. You know, it's just just lovely. I always get this one so I don't forget something. I get this one as well, along with, you know, see, you know, tools like this. You know, it's a small device, but you could mount it. And that's where that uh, little camera, zoom camera I told you about. You hang it on this one, tilt it a little bit. You got a, yourself a long selfie. <laughs> You're now standing on a long thing. So, this is helpful. There's a lot like that. I'll put the links in the description if you're interested. Um, and if I don't, if you don't see the links, please put a comment and say, there you go again. You're forgetting to do that again. So please remind me if I don't put, if you don't see the links, drop a comment. I will appreciate and I apologize to you. But I hope, I, I believe I will do it. It's for my own good. It's not for you. It's for my own good. I do get a kickback from this affiliate links, by the way. For those of you who don't know, it's the same amount to you, but it's definitely going to help us help the channel, keep it running and keep it going and keep us encouraged. And um, yeah, you know, especially when I don't have someone to do the behind the scenes, this guy, this uh, equipment will help me get my coverage. Let's let's take this guy out of the picture. Now this is my old ruggedy bag. It's still useful, right? Um, I don't think we have anything here. Nothing here. Um, uh, this is where I don't put my. This is where I put my laptop. I don't put it anywhere else. Um, yeah, traveling. Yeah, earbuds, noise cancellation. Right. This is what I do. I don't do the e big earphones. Um, on the go, I edit with this thing. I connects to, you know, it is this this thing is uh, it's not extra. Like the sound is not as good as my uh, Sennheiser headphones or my AKG headphones, but it's good enough. It's lighter, lighter than the definitely more comfortable. Actually, I edit in the studio sometimes with this earbuds and. Um, I don't know the name, but I got it from Amazon. I also put the links in the description. The, the point is, I love them because they, they disconnect. I can use this on my hand, on my tablet, and then use this on my phone. But if you put them side by side like this, they will connect and be the same unit. So uh, you charge them, of course, you might be familiar with this, but you know, when this thing is charged, this is a charger on its own. You put it in, you charge your device, maybe it's dead. I'm listening to this one with this one, and then I want to listen to something else. I just take this one, put it back here, take the next one. It's already connected to the iPad, and I start listening from the iPad. But if you put the two together at the same time, they will connect and join with one unit, whichever you were listening at that time. So it's very good. I love it. It's a it's a twin with uh, individual characteristics. All right. So that's that. I've got notepad here. Notepad here, just in case to take notes. Sticky notes. Um, first aid. That's uh, I did um some kind of training with uh, Red Cross. Um, when you CPR. When you learn CPR, I just thought that would be handy. You see, they teach us something in film school, you know, on set, you know, on set safety. You know, you you have to be, you have to be ready for some things. On location, you have to know the nearest hospital. 
you know all that information has to be there in case of an emergency you already know where you're gonna go to and it's possible to have hand slips to them let everybody know you know where the nearest hospital is if need be hopefully not but uh, meanwhile you can have your first aid kit i have a stuff so i have another bag a red cross bag you know with the first aid kit plug it when i take go for an actual shoot i got a couple of them so every time I, I do the training, I get some more goodies, you know, CPR training. Someday it might be handy, I never had to use it one day. But. So finally, this is uh, on this bag, this is my laptop. It is 2019. All right, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? Banky Wellington here, all the way from Lagos, Nigeria, giving a special shout out to Alec Godwin's YouTube page. Much love. Nigeria's most wanted. <laughs> <laughs>